Hi brothers, Marvin here from TechBeerall.com where we do unboxings, reviews, and sexy beerals. And today we're going to do an unboxing, review, and giveaway of the Redmi 9C smartphone from Banggood.com. An affordable smartphone with some fairly decent specs that could be ideal for today's normal online learning. A lot of you guys are asking me to give away a phone so with that, I'm giving this away to one of you guys so make sure to stick around. With that being said, let's get into it. Alright guys, so right here we have the packaging for the Redmi 9C smartphone. And as you can see, we have three color variants. And around the box, we just have some branding. And right here on the side, we have the specific variant for our sample here. So what we have is the midnight gray variant with 2GB of RAM and 32GB of ROM. Again, I'm going to give this away to one of you guys, so make sure to subscribe and watch the entire video. Now, let's see what comes in the package. Upon opening the slide-up type packaging, we're greeted by the Redmi 9C smartphone itself, nicely protected by a soft plastic cover. Removing it reveals another accessory box that houses the SIM ejector pin and a couple of paperwork. Aside from that, inside the box, we also have the rather dated micro USB charging cable and the 10 watts power brick. At first, I thought we have an earphone here, but there's nothing in it. And that's about it for the unboxing experience. Now let's take a look at the Redmi 9C itself. At first look and touch, it feels relatively big and fat while still having some fairly thin bezels. In front, we have a 6.53 inch HD plus 720 by 1600 resolution display with up to 400 nits of brightness and 269 pixels per inch density. It features these nice curved corners and screen to body ratio of around 81.1%. Here in front, we also have a cutout on the top center to make way for the 5 megapixel selfie camera. And we also have a subtle earpiece right above it. Overall, the front side looks fairly clean and simple. Now flipping it on the top side, we have a 3.5mm headphone jack. And flipping it all over on the other side, we have the microphone, the micro USB port, and the downward firing speaker. Turning it on the left side, we have the SIM card tray that supports dual nano SIM cards and a micro SD card. On the other side, we have the volume rocker and the power button nicely positioned on the same side which I always personally prefer and is easier to reach using your thumb. Around the phone, we have the sort of curved edges that not only helps with the grip but also adds up to the overall sleek aesthetic of the smartphone. Now looking at the back, we have this nice textured pattern with a sort of matte finish to it that ultimately makes the backside relatively fingerprint resistant compared to let's say a glossy glass back. And even with a sweaty hand, you'll barely see the fingerprints at all which is quite awesome. Right here on the back, we also have the fingerprint sensor nicely placed on a familiar location and is quite fast, accurate, and responsive. We also have here at the back the triple camera setup that features a 13 megapixel main camera, 2 megapixel macro lens, and a 2 megapixel depth sensor. Speaking of the camera, let's take a look at some sample photos. Now, I wasn't able to take much photos outside due to the Typhoon Rolly, but ultimately, I think the camera on this phone is pretty decent, even the 5 megapixel selfie camera. It just suffers a bit indoors and in a low light environment, but with good lighting, you can expect fairly decent images with this. Now in terms of the user interface, the Redmi 9C features the MIUI 12 based on Android 10 and as you can see the icons are quite huge but definitely an eye candy when it comes to colors, details, and overall look. It is also relatively lightweight though with some apparent pre-installed apps. Browsing through the user interface is not the fastest experience but not laggy either, fairly satisfactory in my opinion. Digging in under the hood, like I said, it features the MIUI 12 based on Android 10 and what we have here is the global version. Looking at the specs, the Redmi 9C is powered by the MediaTek Helio G35 processor with a power VR GE320 GPU with 2GB of RAM and 32GB of ROM. These specs, in my opinion, should be sufficient enough for online learning, browsing, and casual media consumption with light gaming on the side. It also packs a massive 5000mAh of battery that should last you a couple of days with conservative usage. So yeah, this should be a good option for students especially in today's normal. Now before we move on, let's take a look at some benchmarks so that you can have an idea of how the Redmi 9C performs. Now in terms of the quality of the display, even though the resolution is quite low in today's standard with only an HD plus resolution and 269 ppi, I still think this is pretty decent, especially considering its budget price point. The colors are still vivid with enough contrast and details, viewing angles are also pretty good and should suffice any casual media consumption, especially at a screen of this size. The downward firing speaker is also adequate in my opinion, with decent volume levels and clear mids and highs, but the low end is somehow underwhelming. 
Alright guys, like I said, I'm going to give this away to one of you guys. And all you have to do to join this giveaway is to like and share this video. Of course, subscribe to this channel. And most importantly, comment down below one key feature of this smartphone with a hashtag Redmi9C. This giveaway is for Philippine residents only as I will be the one shouldering the shipping. Now to conclude, overall this smartphone like I said earlier should be sufficient enough for normal day-to-day -day tasks and should be ideal for budget-minded parents that would like to give their children a capable device for online learning and casual media consumption. Gaming is also possible with some tweaks on the settings but multitasking is somehow limited due to the small 2GB of RAM. So in order to get a good experience, you might want to open only a couple of apps at the same time. And there you have it guys, thank you for watching. Huge thanks to Bango.com for sending this in and for their never-ending support to this channel. You can get this using the link below and you can also use my code for an extra discount. Thank you for watching, subscribe if you like this, and don't forget to join the giveaway. Have a great day guys, you're awesome!